Catherine Dodge. I work for Atkins and I'm the Early Careers Recruitment Manager. Apprenticeships provide an alternative entry into our organisation. Our apprentices are spread across our entire Atkins business. So we have them doing a multitude of things, but I suppose the, the, the core areas or the skills that they're actually learning will be in things like civil engineering, mechanical engineering, building services, but it's across a wide range. I work for Kinetic. I'm an aeronautical uh, mechanical apprentice. We're an engineering company uh, specialising in weapons testing and uh, the management of military equipment and military bases. I've always enjoyed uh, building things. Um, I've always enjoyed uh, solving problems. And a big part of engineering is uh, creating a solution for a problem. I'm Joe, I'm 20 years old, and I'm currently on the Manufacturing Development Scheme at Rolls-Royce. I've done various placements such as turbines, where I did a business improvement project within the factory. Uh, I've worked in rotatives, which is where we make the shafts and discs for the engines. Uh, and I've also worked in submarines. I'm currently in purchasing and supply chain management. My name's Richard Hondnitz. I am 20 years of old. I am an engineering apprentice for VA Systems. VA Systems covers uh, three different uh, lines of defence. They cover air, uh, land and also sea. My job is a designer to design the submarine, like bulkheads and things like that. We have two kinds of apprenticeships within Jaguar Land Rover. The first one being the Advanced Apprenticeship, which is a four-year apprenticeship. And then we also have the Higher Apprenticeship, and that's a six-year programme. You can develop as much as you want to develop and progress and they've always got those opportunities there. We've got some apprentices that are here today that are on their last year of the advanced apprenticeship and they're going on to international work and they're going to be going over to Brazil. And for such a young age, they can finish their advanced apprenticeship at 20 years old and it's amazing. It's absolutely great to be able to work with these young people and see their passion for the business. We never had access to any sort of show like the Skills Show. Um, so to be able to come somewhere where you can see all the different um, different skills and different businesses that are out there you can go into, different industries, would be really helpful to see what's out there. I think the variety of stuff that you can see here can really help people make that choice or think, you know, I want to go down that direction, I want to be like them. It's been absolutely fantastic. And like even you think it's like more, more about the men and stuff, but there's loads of women in engineering nowadays and it's absolutely brilliant to see. When I was 16, I didn't really know what I wanted to do and the opportunity came of an apprenticeship where I didn't have to be in a school environment and I could earn money at the same time. Um, it was a win-win situation for me.